you know, I was kind of hesitant about making this video. The reason I was hesitant about making this video is because I felt like it was pointless. You know, like it just is a waste of time. A waste of my time. You know, as I've gotten older, I realize now that some things in life is just not in your control. It's just out of your control. It's nothing you can do about certain things. No matter how fucked up it is, it's just nothing you can do about it. There's nothing you can do about it. I was at a friend's house. And... We were in the room just chilling, you know, just just chilling, you know, just relaxing and having a good time talking and all of a sudden I heard pow, 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 gunshots, five of them roll out. Now, yes, you know, I live in Philadelphia and the murder rate in Philadelphia back in 06 and 09 and 08, um, well, actually 06 and 08 was real bad. I think 09 has to be real bad too because there's been so many murders in the city, black on black crime, so many young black men losing their lives to gun violence. It's just, it's, it hurts so bad. It just hurts so bad. You know? And we were sitting in the room and we heard the gunshots and I ran downstairs and the neighbors were out there and I heard all these girls running up and down the block crying and screaming. I seen a couple guys walking around with their shirts off, fist balled, angry, distraught, tears coming in their eyes. I seen all these lights flashing, helicopters, I seen um, the ambulance out there and a guy downstairs. Um, He he was downstairs and I, I went down there and I said, Well, where's the body? And my friend, he was just looking like, Oh my god, what the fuck just happened? And um he said, Look over there near the trash can. I looked outside and I seen the guy leg limped up on the trash can, blood on his shirt and oh god. Mm. They said he was only twenty years old. So the guy just came up to him and told him, where my money, this, this, that. What is wrong with us black men? What, what, what is wrong with us? What is wrong with black people? What, what is wrong with us? And, and, and the fucked up part about it is that it was so many black people out there that was looking like they, like they had a big cheese smile on their face. Like the shit was fucking funny. It's like we thrive off of this shit. We thrive off of violence. We thrive off of drama. And you know, I was telling my mom the other day, I said, Mom, you know what? The hood ain't the hood. Black people make it the hood. In that area of Philadelphia, Southwest Philadelphia, for all my Philly people, Southwest Philadelphia back in the early 90s when all the white folk lived there was peaceful. It was quiet. It was a safe environment. You could take your kids out to the park. You could walk to the grocery store with your kids. You don't have to worry about shit. You know why? Because unfortunately, I hate to say this, but it wasn't no fucking niggas living in, in, in Southwest Philadelphia back then. But the moment we brung our black asses up in Southwest and all the white folk moved away, that's when it becomes the hood. You know how they say a house is not a house unless there's people there? A chair is not a chair unless somebody's sitting there. A church is not a church unless it's filled with holy, sanctified Christians. Well... The hood is not a hood unless black people is there. And I feel so bad saying this, but you know what? Our people are sick. We have some serious rooted problems. I don't understand the mentality of us black men where we feel it's okay to take somebody's life. That is a sick person. How can you sleep at night?
All we doing is proving society right. When they say that we a bunch of crazy animals and, 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 and all we do is kill each other and, and cause trouble and, and murder each other and, and is that we're proving them right. All we all we doing all we doing is proving them right. I just don't understand the mentality of us black people. Why are we like this? Why what is so hard about going to work and getting a job? Pursuing your education, going to college, trying to better yourself, trying to do something positive with your life. What is wrong with us young black men? We think it's okay to kill each other. Oh, because a, 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 a man look at you wrong, you want to take his life? Oh, because he owed you five dollars and he ain't give it back to you when you wanted him to give it back. You going to take his life? Black on black crime, it, it, it just never stops. It never stops. It's getting worse and worse every year. I mean, so many black men are losing their lives. I mean, I'm talking about young black men. In their 20s, in their 30s. It is sickening. What is wrong with us? And then you got so many black mothers out there, older black people, adults, who condone this and who promote this and who are for this who tell their kids to go out there and make that easy money I've seen plenty of black women tell their young black boys you, you, you better go sell some drugs where my money at I heard about the young black guy, Darion Albert, a few weeks ago. I heard that he, he was beaten to death. He was only 16 years old. He had a whole bunch of crazy, out of control black folk, as usual. Proving everybody right, proving society right. A whole bunch of black folk that don't know how to act. It's like, it's like we're, we're like fucking animals. And sometimes I agree with the, the, the white folk and the things they say about us. We like fucking sick animals. Something is seriously wrong with the minds of black people. It seems like everywhere there's a group of black people, there's always some drama. You notice that shit? You can't have a whole bunch of black people together in one place. So, some, something's going to pop off. Somebody going to get their ass whooped or somebody going to get killed. And it's so sad that we are like this. Black people are fucking sick. It's getting to the point where I fucking hate my own kind. I don't even, it's getting to the point I don't even want to fucking have anything to do with them. I don't even want to be even associated with them. And that's how you feel when you love your people so much. When you love black folk as much as I do, you hate them. Because we have the potential to do so much better, but we don't fucking choose to. We don't want to do better. We don't give a fuck. We have that I don't give a fuck mentality. We have nasty attitudes. We are evil. We are spiteful. We are mean. And I don't understand it. I understand that we're living up. In, we're living in a fucked up society. I understand that, you know, we're not given the same privileges and rights as other races of people. I understand we have it hard. And sometimes we have to work twice as hard as an Asian or a white person or a Latino to get ahead. I understand we have it the worst. I understand that we're at the bottom of the totem pole. But that should motivate us and give us the drive to do better, to prove them wrong. And all we continue to, 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 to do day in and day out is prove them right. We're like fucking animals. We act sick. Something is wrong with us. We go around killing each other. We're so angry. I was telling my friend, um, me and her was on the bus not too long ago when she said, black people are just so angry. And I said, I, I know. You look at them the wrong way. It's like they, they look at you, roll their eyes. They say, what, what is wrong with us? We just don't care. Martin Luther King died for us to act like fucking animals. And it's like we, we, we just we we understand the situation. We under, we know that we are the most hated. And then we hate each other. We destroy each other. We bring each other down. We're like a fucking crab in a fucking bucket. We kill each other and destroy each other. We hate each other. Talk about each other. Backstab each other. Bring each other down. Put hit out, hit time on each other, kill each other. It's just so amazing how many black men have died in the last few months in Philadelphia. Had to be at least about 50 by now. You know, it's like you just give up.
slavery been over too long and we still acting like fucking animals. Like we don't know how to conduct ourselves right. But like somebody said, you know what? The hood is the hood because black people are living there. Because before black people came in this neighborhood, when it was all white folk, it was perfect. It was it was nice. It was safe. When black folk came here, then that's when it became an unsafe environment. So just remember that. The hood is the hood because black people are there. And I don't mean to sound like this. You know, it, it shouldn't be like this. I shouldn't have this hate for my people. But I am beginning to hate my people. And I'm going to tell you why. It's because I see that we have so much potential, but we just choose. We just choose to prove the white man right. We just choose to bring each other down. We just choose to destroy each other, to kill each other. It's, it's like it's not even worth talking about because it ain't going to change.